absolute dick. They find it hard to get along with anybody. They're massively disruptive. They think the world owes them something. They're your biggest problem in terms of being able to manage them for their timekeeping or sickness absence, whatever the case may be. But you know what? They are the best widget maker ever in the world, the statistic. But they don't fit within anything. They don't work well with other people. Why would you bring that person into your business? I would rather not have a person in my business filling that role than to get an asshole in who's great at what they do. Because they're just going to alienate everybody else. And it doesn't matter how good they are, it's not gonna make up for the impact they're gonna have in a negative way on everything else in my business. So if I just base things on their quality of what they can do, I could find myself having a great person who can do the job, but who's the worst person for my business and my team.